What's up, y'all? It's your boy Solo Ball here, back again with another day, another reaction, another video. Y'all, it is finally, finally here. Reality Resort has officially became a reality. For those of you that don't know, this is the series that I voice act in, and I voice act the character named Drew, as I like to call him, the Black Peril. So we're just gonna go ahead and dive right into this reaction, but make sure you definitely speak this match that love button, subscribe if you like, gotta take us any single more time, and also keep on supporting the show, y'all, just so we can continue having more new episodes come out here in the foreseeable future. Without further ado, let me go ahead and get this reaction video started by first putting on the headphones. Bah! And just to let you know, I've already seen this episode, y'all, but I'm just gonna be reacting to it so I can like hit up points that I didn't get to see the first time, and also uh certain things that like certain like you know inside behind the scenes stuff i'd like to talk about with you guys so here we go reality resort man episode one vacation is all i have ever wanted we got the first contestant once again <laughs> coming aboard y'all it's the bird man the bird the og here we go y'all <laughs> where everyone wants to be right no work no work no stress no stress no problems no none who wouldn't prefer that over the hustle and bustle of everyday life? Right. <sighs> if only it were that simple. This, this might look like paradise, but our future contestants will quickly realize this Whoa! may be anything but an extensive vacation. I'm Victoria Moore, your host for the next 40 days. You feel me? We're all gonna be in for a treat as we witness 16 tourists. Look at him, bro. Look at him. And I just gotta say, Ken Koi killed it on her lines, man. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> like, I gotta give her so many props, Anywhere man. Anywhere from 18 to 50 years old compete against one another <laughs> on this resplendent <laughs> resort for a grand total of $250,000. This is just the first installment in the newly founded Reality Gauntlet. Across three different and unique <laughs> competition shows, yes. contestants will be competing not only for the prize money, right. but for enough legacy points to qualify for the ultimate trial. Yep. Reality royalty. royalty. Only then will the best of the best duke it out to win the $500,000 mm -hmm. cash prize and the title of Reality Monarch. That's right. Look at no, the main let's man, Brad. Don't get ahead of ourselves. Don't get ahead of ourselves now. We've got a long season ahead of us here on this beautiful island. Yes, sir. Are you ready to meet the tourists and watch the drama unfold? I hope y'all ready, y'all. Our adventure starts now. Come on. Welcome to the premiere of Reality, Reality Resort. Resort. Come on, man. Y'all, y'all, this is gonna be crazy. Y'all, place your best in the comment section below. Who's your prediction on uh first boot? <laughs> Just let me know, man. Just let me know who y'all think. <laughs> Here we go. Ah, ah, hold up. <laughs> you want to put a K on my mind. I got the belief of the night. This takes will never be higher. So I'll do it every day. Uh-huh. And this will make or break me. Yeah. No camera loves me. Never let things get ugly. Look at these designs, y'all. Yo, that theme song hypes me up so much. It makes me want to like do the robot, start doing a worm, you know what I'm saying? Start doing backflips, side flips, kick flips, all sorts of flips, y'all. <laughs> Come on, y'all. Let's go. Here we go. And it begins. Oh, shoot. Here we go. Uh. Yo, this is crazy. Like, this is actually happening right now. No way. <laughs> the brochure was actually for real. At last, at long last. I am fulfilling a fantasy. Everyone, <laughs> welcome to Reality Resort. Yep. Your new home for the next, well, however long you last. Now. <laughs> Yo, that's personal though. However long you last, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Cause nobody knows when they're gonna get eliminated. They just don't know. <laughs> Let's do a roll call. Annalise, Brad, Charles, yeah. Cheryl, yeah. Drew, Finn, <laughs> Bro, why is Drew so mad though? <laughs> He's in shock, man. Are 
Kylie, Marcus, Marcus. Monica, Olive, Sara, <laughs> Seth, Dino. Yeah, I just want to say there's something I just love about all these characters, man. I know I'm pausing a lot, but you know, I just got to get my insight on this. Topaz and VJ. VJ? You're all here. Consider yourselves pioneers, yeah. as you are all the first victims of this brand new contest. In order to get to the end and have a chance to win 250 Gs, you'll need That's to right. overcome the intense challenges and stressful situations that will unfold in front of you. Yep. But most importantly, the way you navigate around one another in this game will prove detrimental Facts. in deciding who will be winning that big check with the prize money on it. Facts. Ooh, I know, that was a lot. But trust me, it'll only get worse. No, <laughs> oh, no. as for my role, I'm, I'm not here to be your babysitter. As if I could be your dad. Ain't no way I'd let you babysit me. Mm-hmm, <laughs> you wish. <laughs> Bro, these character interactions be killing me, man. Anyway, <laughs> I'm here man. to enforce the rules and facilitate challenges. Should you decide to throw hands with anyone, I will not get in your way. So, with that being said, I think it's time we show you inside. Okay? There we go. Um, are you endorsing violence? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm endorsing good television. Follow along now. <laughs> so ominous. I didn't think this place was gonna be real. Man, probably just a glitch in the simulation. This is gonna be one wild social experiment. It feels so weird just hearing myself. <laughs> I, I just was like, hold up. <laughs> hmm. I'm getting a feeling that I'm going to be manifesting a win here. <laughs> Bro, I love her lab, bro. Her lab is just like so, you know, on point, bro. You know what I'm saying? I hope Let's you're go. all getting situated in your new living space. But don't get too comfortable. Because you never know when the game is going to decide your time is over. Uh huh. Ooh, so ominous. <laughs> Let's not dampen the mood within the first hour, though, okay? Agreed. <laughs> I'm still trying to soak it all in. This place is crazy. I bet the gym is sick. Wow, that might be the most predictable thing I'll hear all day. <laughs> hey man, when you go on to get some gains, you gotta get some gains, you know what I'm saying? My boy Tino, he loves his protein now, man, you feel me? <laughs> That's the first thing he wanna do when he get here. He's like, hey, I'm gonna hit up the gym, man. I'm gonna do this deadlift, some squats. <laughs> you see my boy like, he wham, man. <laughs> Come on. Anywho, you'll have enough time later to check it out. Now, let's go over a few baseline rules, shall okay. we? You're all aware by now that there will be no internet access on this entire property. You have no. been stripped of any devices as this is a technology-free zone. But this shouldn't be of any concern for you all, right? Isn't that the point of retreating to a vacation? To I get guess. away <laughs> from the outside world. Stop the forced communication and just... Relax. Unwind. Oh, yes, that sounds amazing. <laughs> I thought we all knew this was a game show. No <laughs> one should be anticipating any relaxation. Hey, she ain't wrong, though. You know what I'm saying? She, <laughs> Isadora ain't wrong. <laughs> <laughs> right you are, pigtailed princess. Not pigtailed princess. <laughs> everyone here is a legal adult. But that doesn't mean we expect you to act like one still. <laughs> Here's how the game works. Your days here will be structured into blocks. Each block is themed and will last three days, three days excluding this opening one and the finale. You'll be split into two teams of eight, which will dissipate after the first five contestants have been evicted. Yikes. So when and how will the teams be determined? I've got some reservations about some people here already. <laughs> I want to say I really like Topaz, y'all. You know what I'm saying? She's a character I actually really, really like. Someone's antsy to get going. Patience. Don't you want to learn about the point system? The point of what now? <laughs> OMG, OMG, yes! I <laughs> oh my gosh. No self kills me, bro. <laughs> I need to know the deep. 
You will all have ample opportunities to earn legacy points during each phase oh in the game. God. For example, winning an immunity competition during the team phase awards everyone on the winning team some points. Right. However, losing said competition will deduct points from everyone on the losing team. Right, you may check right. check the monitor at any time during your stay for a full list of what earns and loses you points. However, you cannot see how many points you or anyone else has. Right. We have to keep some things a secret, no? Ooh, <laughs> so it's like a game within a game. I'm <laughs> so meta. After the first five oh evictions of the season, the teams will merge and we will begin the jury phase. Bada -bing, bada -bing. That's right. If you get evicted during the team phase, you lose out on voting for a winner on the finale night. Ooh. The last thing I'll leave you with for now is to be on the lookout for legacy idols. There are six of these tiny emblems scattered amongst the proximity of the resort. Yikes. If you find one, you may either redeem it for points look, look, or Look at Brad. It. Look, Brad's ready. <laughs> My boy's ready. Like, you see, he's already ready to start looking for that, John, man. <laughs> for invincibility in the next nomination ceremony. However, be warned that if you use it for safety, you will lose points. This game sounds harder than I thought. It's a lot. <laughs> Are there any refunds? We didn't pay to be on this show, you ding dong. Listen, I like me a girl as fine as that Annalise chick. But mama didn't raise no fool. I know not to get involved with girls dumber than I. Oh my gosh. Dumber than me? <laughs> uh, I skipped college, okay? Bro, Seth is so funny, man. <laughs> At the end of the season, you'll find out your point <laughs> oh, total man. and subsequently, which five of you will have qualified for reality royalty. Now, why doesn't everyone unwind and check out the rest of the resort for a little? I'll call you back in about an hour. All right. I've always been a rather motivated fella, but being here, man, I can just feel it taking me to the next level. Look at my boy, Nobody's face. gonna stop me from having a good time or winning that moolah. As long as I don't think about Patricia, that is. Which I'm definitely not doing right now. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Okay, He's thinking. <laughs> so my job is literally understanding how people's brains work and forming strategies to capitalize on their behaviors. Is that not the perfect skill set for this game? Watch out, world, because I'm about to pull a marketing stunt so crazy, it'll make you think I'm promoting a circus. <laughs> the boys. The gang. Now this, this place feels just like home. <laughs> you one of those fellows who sleeps in the gym too? <laughs> yeah, I actually am. <laughs> it cuts down on my commute and monthly expenses. You'd be surprised just how comfortable some of these benches can be. Rad, big man. <laughs> I'm all about ingenuity. Being the president of my fraternity back at university, I've always got to be thinking of ways to guide my fellow brothers. Sigma Chi for life! Uh -huh. Glad to see a young man with a good hand on his shoulders. Sheesh! That's one way to make me feel old. <laughs> what? You can't be older than 25, no? Huh. Appreciate it. I'm turning 30 soon, and I ain't even got a wife yet. That's <laughs> wild, old man. It's alright, my dude. There's plenty of good-looking girls here. Maybe you'll find your match. It's never too late. Yeah, brother's running out of time. Turning 30 is basically giving away your rights to have fun. Must be tough. Huh. You're telling me. Man, Brad the OG, man, you know what I'm saying? Over here doing a little workout, you feel me? Almost been a decade since I was drafted. Hoping this show will give me a shot to save my career. Well, if there are any baseball challenges, I for sure hope you're on my team. Hey! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm sensing someone's already developing a crush. <laughs> oh, what? No, the way she like caressed the window though, bro. <laughs> Who, <Instantly>. me? <laughs> no, no, I was just um admiring the view. <laughs> Relax, Jesus, girly. I would totally be checking my reflection out in the window too if I didn't already know I looked amazing. Speaking of, can you girls believe this place? It's literally stunning. Definitely, uh... Stark contrast from university, that's for sure. I've already decided I'm never leaving. The sun hits way too well in this spot. <laughs> Looks like it'll be <laughs> you the finale yeah. then, girl. Aw, oh, this glow of confidence looks so good on you. Won't last for too long. I'm afraid you're both wrong. 
But there's no sense in trying to convince you of that right now. <laughs> <laughs> bro, wow, the you laugh are... is so ominous, bro. It's so, it's so ominous. Very confident women. <laughs> I run a fortune telling business. My psychic powers are borderline non-existent. But where's the fun in acknowledging that? And that's why she's ominous. She does fortune telling. <laughs> I'm here to win. And as far as I'm concerned, there's no right or wrong way to do so. <laughs> Olive! Attention, everyone! Meet me outside, pronto! Uh -oh. Two things. First off, a gourmet dinner will be served tonight inside the dining room. A celebration of your first day. Sounds fire. Secondly, you might have noticed these papers I have in my hand. These are the short questionnaires that we had you fill out on the yacht. Your answers have ultimately decided how you are to be split into teams. Oh, good. I thought it was going to be one of those personality quizzes. <laughs> I don't need a piece of paper to tell me I have issues. Nope. We all could have told you that, bucko. <laughs> as fun as it would be to deep dive into your personal problems, I'm afraid it's a little too early for that. Instead, we deduced which type of vacation you prefer. A tropical climate or an exotic destination. Ah. Without further ado, here are the results. Here we go. Those who preferred a tropical vacation are the following. Kylie, Drew, Brad, Isidore, Finn, Cheryl, Annalise, and Marcus. Which means <laughs> those who preferred an exotic vacation are VJ, Tino, Olive, Topaz, Charles, Sara, Monica, and Seth. Monica? The wink. Both of these options are just socially constructed terms to make you fork over money to whatever country's government you're fleeing to. You'd be fun at parties. Now for the. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Freaking Drew, man. <laughs> Uh, that that line took me a few takes to be honest. Team names, Team Tropics. You are now known as the Tropical Toucans. Oh, cute! Who doesn't love toucans? As I like for toucans. Team Exotic, you'll no, be Sam. called the Exotic Emus. Oh, my daughter just did a project on emus. Oh. This is perfect. See, Danielle, it was meant to be. This one reeks of desperation. Erotic emos would have sounded better. Yep. Glad that one's not on my team. <laughs> oh, ignore her remark. It's a pleasure to be working. <laughs> oh, man. Put y'all in whatever capacity that ends up being, as I'm still yet to understand exactly how these challenges are going to work. I'll say, hopefully, our diverse array of talents will prove to be too much for the emus to handle. <laughs> yes, I've got so many that will come in handy. Oh, she said talents? I thought she said palettes. As in makeup. <laughs> I've got plenty of products that will help her out. She's definitely going to be one, like, you could just tell, bruh. You know what I'm saying? Like, she's definitely going to be one that's going to, you know, spice up the competition. <laughs> What? You all see her too, right? <laughs> the name's Topaz, track coach for future Olympians and stars. I take immense pride in helping others achieve their greatest dreams, so I would love it if we could all- <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I- Relatable, Charles. have a problem when it comes to people getting hurt. I burst out in laughter. It's a visceral response I quite literally cannot prevent. <laughs> Darn leg. Fun fact, that's actually the uh, same voice of Alec as uh, on this venture cam. <laughs> it's never been the same since I tore my ACL. Doctors don't know why it never healed properly. Whatever. Nothing faces me anymore. Who fell? I know I didn't. I'm going <laughs> strong, are we? <laughs> Real talk, I love the energy. This group is going to be fun. Sure, if we didn't have too many conflicting personalities, then maybe our fortune would have been, well, more fortunate. Yo, there's a lot of strong personalities in this cast, though. <laughs> and what's that supposed to mean? Here we go. I don't mean to interrupt quality team bonding time. Anything but that is happening right now. But you didn't think this was all for today, did you? <laughs> it's time for your first challenge, folks! Welcome to the inaugural immunity competition. 
This will be your first challenge at the beginning of each new block. Uh -huh. The winning team will receive safety for the remainder of said block, Facts. while the others are at jeopardy of being nominated for eviction. The first theme of the season is vacation. While it's true that you're competing for a quarter of a million dollars, we'd also like to remind you of how luxurious your new temporary home is. Yep. And what better way to do that than to force you to make me a drink? Yo, you sure you? <laughs> Yo, that drink look fire though, man. Like, don't get it twisted. That drink look fire. To of how luxurious your new Looks temporary like a home <laughs> is. And what better way to do that than to force you to make me a drink? You sure you, my ex-wife? Here's how <laughs> toasting a mixer works. One by one, you will all take turns running over to the middle of the beach. Using your hands, you will dig to find one of seven ingredients needed to create my favorite mixed drink. Ah. Once found, run back and tag it to me You can tell she likes a Bloody Mary. <laughs> Victoria likes a good, solid Bloody Mary. <laughs> You'll do so until everyone has found and given an ingredient to the eighth team member, who will concoct the beverage and bring it to me, lounging underneath this umbrella. The first team to do Chill. so will win immunity. Are you ready? Because this competition starts now. Here we go. Who here is good at mixing drinks? Scratch that. Not enough time to figure that out. I'll make an order for us. I'm sorry, did I miss the team captain vote? Oh no. Tino, me, Olive, Monica, Charles, and then Sarah. VJ, you look like you can handle your liquor. You mix the drink. Should I be offended? I should be, right? Psst, I'm not though. Hey, <laughs> what about Seth? Seth? Oh crap, you're right. Where is he? I throw a 93, <laughs> 95 on a good day. Hey, he trying to he trying to get his riz on, man. <laughs> we got the Rizzly Bear right here, man. I bet I'd get that up to 98 if I knew you were up in the stands watching. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Stop it. What sport is this again? Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, that's no. a thing nobody could have foreseen. What? Okay, maybe I'm all race a bit of a fool after all. <laughs> Can't blame a guy for trying. Hey, Adelise. <laughs> Party's over here. Speaking of which, I'll handle the Bloody Mary. I'm sort of a mixologist prodigy. Huh. I'm sorry, kid, but leave the alcohol to the actual adult. I'll handle it. Oh, God. Something tells me that's a bad idea. <laughs> uh, how silly of me. I just realized uh, my ex-wife's name is Mary. <laughs> Anyways, uh, Mr. Frat, why don't you take this one? Mr. Frat. Probably for the best if I stay away from alcohol while I'm here. I don't have a problem, all right? I just, I mean, I did, but not anymore. <laughs> this is going to be chaos, y'all. Look at Tino, man. Tino, Tino's a goat, man. Tino's a goat. Ugh. Yeah, this you music. strike me like an espresso <laughs> martini kind of gal. <laughs> Look, now it's his turn. <laughs> First it was Seth, now it's Brad Try to, you know, <laughs> reel her in. <laughs> they going fishing, bro. I gave it away. I love espresso martinis. I just have good judgment of character. Speaking of which, that Seth guy. <laughs> definitely not who you want to be hanging out with in this game. Really? He seemed nice. Why do you say that? Guys like him act like that. <laughs> but they're hiding ulterior motives. I can read right through him. Had to kick a couple dudes like that out of the fraternity. Unfortunately. Your turn, Annalise. <laughs> oh, God. Does anyone else find it odd that our challenge involves handling alcohol while we have three people here who can't even legally drink? Ah, <sighs> the age old mystery of the Forbidden <laughs> Fruit Punch Brigade. It's all part of the grand plan to keep us distracted from the real issues. They want us fixated on who's sipping what while the intergalactic hamster overlords tighten their grip on the cheese supply chain. <laughs> okay. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> he just spawns in, bro. <laughs> I can't believe it, man. <laughs> I'm a, I'm gonna say that uh that those lines probably took me several tries to do, man, cuz I wanted it to get like I wanted it to be perfect, man. <laughs> like look at the way he just spawns in. Like where did he come from? <laughs> Look! It just spawns in! Does 
anyone else find it <laughs> odd that our challenge involves handling alcohol while we have three people here who can't even legally drink? <sighs> the age old mystery of the Forbidden Fruit Punch Brigade. It's all part of the grand plan to keep us distracted from the real issues. They want us fixated on who's sipping what while the intergalactic hamster overlords tighten their grip on the cheese supply chain. <laughs> I can't believe it, man. Okay, maybe he's more fun than I thought. <laughs> fun to make fun of. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, Drew would ease the door, bro. Oh my gosh. <laughs> These two are going to be something else, man. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> the straw's laughing again. Why is she drinking it? <laughs> oh, man. Such faster, chaos. Faster, faster, faster. Come on, college girl. This is riding on you. Um, Topaz? That might work for athletes, but in my experience, students do not thrive under the same pressure. Only soft ones. <laughs> Pretend you're trying really hard to find your son's cell phone after yours died during the live finale premiere of Chilling Out with the Chamberlains! The Worcestershire <laughs> sauce. It's right behind her. Ah, you were right! I got it! Hey! Hello! Ah! Huh. <laughs> yo, this is tight, y'all. <laughs> it's tight! Bro, I'm just gonna say this scene right here is like my favorite scene in this episode, man. Just the montage, y'all. It's so good, man. Like, look at this, bro. Look at this. <laughs> look at him, bro. <laughs> you feel me? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> it's so good, man. God day. <laughs> mm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That is definitely a Bloody Mary. Congrats, Tropical Toucans. You have won this immunity competition. Yay! 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 Super <laughs> oh my gosh. Looks like there'll be two emus up for eviction this block. But I think we've had enough fun for one day. Why don't you all get cleaned up and enjoy your dinner tonight? The nomination ceremony awaits you tomorrow. Great job mixing that drink. I really thought VJ had it in the bag. <laughs> oh, that... That was nothing. Appreciate you, though. Ah. I'm pretty ticked we lost that. But no sense in crying over spilled milk. Facts. We've got an even bigger task ahead of us. I'm a fighter, so I refuse to give up this early. Facts. <laughs> Am I worried that I'm a potential option for nomination tomorrow? Only as concerned as the old man who joins my yoga class full of beautiful women. Trust me, I've danced my way out of tighter corners than this. <laughs> Besides, I've got a backup plan. Uh-oh. Oh, shoot. He's <laughs> it. Be eight we players have just earned their first legacy points, whereas the other eight got their first taste of loserdom. But a lot can happen within the next few days. Who will be our first two nominees of the season? And which one of them will be the first evicted? We'll be You'll first. have to find out on the next episode of Reality, Reality Resort. Resort. Uh huh. Y'all, 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 y'all. Look, look at this, y'all. Uh, hey, hey, hey. Uh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, uh. Let's get it, y'all. Let's get it. Let's get it, huh? Bro, it's like outro is so good too, man. It just hypes me up. Like, look at this. Just the whole cast, man. Just the transition, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> look at this. It's it's so, it's like, so smooth, man. And it just shows all the portraits. It's so intense on top of that. Mm. 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 
You know what I'm saying? Yo, the hype is real, y'all. The hype is freaking real. Reality freaking resort, y'all. And here's all the fan art, too. All the support, y'all. All the support. Look at that. Y'all. This is awesome, man. This is so good. I love it, man. <laughs> Look at this, man. Y'all, thank you all, all so much for the support, though, for real, man. This is crazy. Oh, no. <laughs> yes, sir. Yo, this is amazing. I don't know my best son. I freaking love this, man. This is awesome. Hey, hey, hey. And then, of course, you can buy your merch and whatnot, too, on top of that. Thank you all again for the support. Y'all, drop the freaking headphones on it, man. So, that's episode one of Reality Resort, man. It's It's been an honor to be a part of this project. And I'm just so proud to see the whole entire production of it officially come to life, man. So, y'all let me know, what do you think of the, uh, you know, first episode? And also, who's your prediction on the first boot? You know what I'm saying? Also, on top of that, who would you like to see win, man? There's so many questions out there. So, just let me know in the comment section below, y'all. Anyways, that's all I got for you guys today. And, of course... Um, we don't know when episode two is coming out yet. I'm just gonna say that there's no uh, confirmation date on that, but it'll all depend on how well this uh, first episode does and also how much support it gets early on. You know what I'm saying? So we'll just have to wait and see for once that time comes, y'all. So that's all I got for you guys today. And yeah, I will see y'all next time for whatever we got next time. So hope y'all take care, take it easy, and bowl around.